this is why I don't get the modern day game, you know. No, no, I get no, play, no. I get the players go, Oh yeah, you know, I'm rested. I'm like, what? That walking out in front of a crowd, the abuse cheering your name, abusing your name, it it's just the greatest feeling yeah. ever, ever. And the exhilaration, you know, right? Sometimes you get beat, but you, you just think, right, next week comes again, and you think, right, I want that feeling again. And I, I get players now, and you see them, they sat on the bench, and I just think, are you getting this? And I, I don't know. It's just it's just different. It's just different. Well, it's the boyhood dream. I think every boy wants to play for their club, don't they? And the guys yeah. like yourself, who are lucky enough to have done it, you That's, kind of recognize you know, the dream. Lucky. You look, you yeah. need that bit of look so I, to, to, to embrace it. Absolutely, because it's fleeting as well. But actually, didn't Steve Bruce say something about that? Uh, was it today or yesterday about like the, the lack of crowds in current football um, affects the smaller teams as opposed to the bigger teams because it, it generates and pushes the players forward? Yeah. I think he's yeah, absolutely. Like, like, yeah. It, it play, playing in front of a crowd makes a massive difference. I can't tell you Absolutely. how big it, it makes. You've all, you've, but you've also got to remember as well. Um, it depends on characters as well. I remember Steve Guppy coming to Newcastle. Steve Guppy was a quality player, great lad, and everything else. Yeah, but he was the ground. The, the, but the club was too big for him at that time. He couldn't handle the the pressure of playing in front of the Geordies, the players who he was playing with at the time. He just wasn't mentally ready. And he was, he was a nervous wreck. He was a nervous wreck coming to training and everything else. So Steve Guppy walking out in a small crowd and everything else, you'll see a different player. Put him in front of 50,000 people, he tenses up and you, and you, and you, can't, you can't cope with it. But then also, you know, like you said, it's like you, you, you play at certain grounds and, you know, crowds can be right on top of you. You know, I, was, I look mm -hmm. like the Dell was all, you know, Upton Park was always horrible to play at. You know, they're giving you abuse. They're, they they can literally spit at you, you know, and they do. And you 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 kind of it's intimidating, and 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 it's how you learn to react from it. Um, I always think, you know, like you play again, the the teams now playing with no crowd uh, and a big open pitch. It's the, the, I would say the bigger teams are going to have a lot better. They they they'd be much better chance. It just, Absolutely, it, it's going to suit them so much more, miles more. 